So finally, we have the jump for PHUN after a few days of consolidation over our support. And today we have almost 15%. The volume is doing all right, almost 100 million. And of course, we discussed this price action before. Of course, we took profit for PHUN before around the 23rd of January when we discussed this price action and our discord and we said to our hunters, Take your profit because we're going to get rejected. It was around here, the 22nd of January, where we said the rejection zone is around the 47. However, in today's video, we have to discuss what we should do, guys. What we should do right now for the price action for PHUN before the end of this month. And where we're going to go and where we should hold for tomorrow and friday to confirm the squeeze so before we start our video plus the like button and the way in don't forget guys spread the love and let's get right to it and discuss phun of course to do uh, to see where the price will go in the coming days so first of all let me just show you what we should expect for phun first let me just show you here for PHUN, we have the reversal from the 25, as we discussed before. We said this is the most important level to hold for PHUN. And of course, we reverse exactly around our level, around the 20, uh, 25 cents. And we have the reversal around, uh, yes, uh, on Tuesday. And now we did 35%. This is a really good jump. And now we're doing a new high every time or a new low here. One, two, three and now we have the jump. So we have a confirmation that we have a huge whale bot on the market open on Tuesday. And now the price getting near this level of resistance, guys, the 42. So we have to watch out for this level for PHUN to squeeze because we don't want to have a rejection before that. Let me just show you what I mean. Because we have a hidden seller before that, around the 36.20, to confirm are we going to have a weakness and pull back down or are we going to have a squeeze up? Because the 36.20 will confirm that situation. Because if we got rejected here, it's mean a weakness and we're going to go down again toward the 25. The other scenario, if we broke the 36.20 and we have a huge jump right around the 42, is mean this is the bottom, guys, and we're going to have the squeeze. So this is the first signal that PHUN will squeeze for tomorrow or the next week before the end of this month. However, if we went there around the 42, 48, again, we're not clear yet, guys. We're not clear. So we have the first level of resistance. The short will add their position around this level. So they have two levels before they cover up. The first level, as we said, are on this level, the 36. The second level, the most important one that we're going to have the squeeze for PHUN is the 42 and the 48 for the coming days. However, if we go right now for DWAC, because we have a huge jump of uh, almost 8%, the good thing for DWAC have a really good reaction. First, we held the 3470, and of course, we have the breakout now and we holding over the $40. So this is good reaction. The first test you see here, we have a rejection and the price went down and now we have a breakout and accumulating up. So this is a bit of weakness. We should have pumped right away, at least until a 44, but we consolidating sideways. You know why? Because PHUN have a bit of rejection coming up. That's why we don't have continuation for DWAC because both of them have the same momentum. It's kind of uh, like uh, GameStop and AMC before. Now we have DWAC and PHUN pumping side by side. That's why we have a bit of anticipation for people who bought uh, DWC watching a PHUN squeeze. So we have to watch out for this reaction. Holding over the $40 would be really good uh, for this stock to continue to go higher. We have a profit taken, as we said before, the 49.24, and we have the 61.90. For PHUN, for my opinion, we have to watch out for two profit taking, guys. 61.12 and the 7577. So those two levels that we might have a test for, and then we might have a pullback for those two uh, levels that we might have a test for on Friday, guys. So we have 
th Thursday and Friday, just two days. Some of you already told me, Jesus, what's going on, man? The price didn't squeeze yet. I understand. This is trading for you guys. You have to be patient. You have to wait until the price pump. Because during the waiting, during the accumulation, market maker loading up. They be ready for the squeeze. Normal trader or day trader that uh, just began uh, trading just yesterday, they just want action every time. This is not uh, like, uh, that is not trading. Trading is almost 90% waiting and 10% is taking action and taking profit. If you manage to do that, you're going to make profit. If you don't do that, you're going to start to lose money. So if you don't want to lose money and understand how the market works, the link in the comment section below to join our Patreon Discord. As we said, we always warn our hunter around the short sellers level so you can take profit and buy around the dip. This is how you uh, prevent yourself from losing money at the same time, uh, like preserve the profit that you already made. Thank you for watching, guys, and see you in the next update tomorrow, of course, 30 minutes before the market open to our live streaming to discuss PHN live. Thank you for watching and see you in the next update.